Hi Leo, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for all of your love and support and for subscribing to my channel as well as my second vlog channel. I truly appreciate it. And today we are going to find out how does your person currently feel about you and also some love and money advice at the end of your reading as well if you are interested. All right, spirits and angels, please show me. How does Leo's person currently feel about them? Leo, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be how your person feel about you or how you feel about them instead, okay? So they are indecisive, two of wands here. It looks like um, they're sitting at a crossroad right now, thinking about whether to reach out to you with the Knight of Pentacles uh, to offer you peace. Uh, it can be a, a peace offering or reconciliation or an apology, all right? So Ace of Wands is in reverse and got the Queen of Swords here in reverse as well. So they feel like you're not interested anymore. They feel like you have lost your passion or the, or the desire to be with them because Queen of Swords is in reverse that you are still angry with them, okay, for some reason here. We've got the Eight of Swords here in reverse and the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like eventually, uh, Leo, maybe they will make, uh, maybe they'll take action, okay, maybe because free will is always at play. Currently, what's showing is that maybe they will offer you this new beginning here, Ace of Pentacles. Um, perhaps commitment, perhaps starting over. Be committed to you and be loyal to you. It could mean that. Or offer you something of value, okay? Eight of Swords in reverse also indicates them finally maybe will come out of, you know, uh, yeah. <laughs> to me, it's a little bit of an isolation, yeah, similar to the Hermit in reverse coming out from overthinking about you, about whether they are going to or that they want to reach out to you and offer you this commitment. It does look like, yeah, with the hermit in reverse, they feel like they feel like they have um they have soul search quite a bit. I feel like they've reflected quite a bit on about you and I feel like eventually yeah perhaps they will take action towards you. Maybe all right. Five of Swords is in reverse. They feel like they don't want to play games anymore and they just want to be honest. They just want to come clean. It's almost like both of you have learned some lessons from each other here, okay? We've got the Empress in reverse. Let's see more. Yeah, they want to heal this connection. They feel like at one point in time you were giving a lot to them. You were nurturing them, you know, t almost to a point where, you know, you... <laughs> You were kind of selfless, okay? Like you were giving your all to them, even if it means that there's not much left for yourself. So I feel like they may want that back, okay? The high priestess in reverse, finally realizing, I feel, and maybe coming out of uh, silence, okay? Maybe they want to come out of silence, finally talk to you in regards to the two, three of swords in reverse to heal this connection, to heal each other's hearts, okay? Temperance in reverse, they're losing their patience here, or that they may feel that, you know, um, a little bit of a temper, maybe they feel like you have a temper, or they have a temper, I don't know, either one of you, but uh, they're losing their patience as well, okay? Looks like they really want to take action, but they're just indecisive right now, they're not sure as in when or whether they should or shouldn't. See more. Yeah, they feel like you've given up already, okay? But also, Nine of Cups in reverse, I don't see them being really happy uh, ever since you, okay? Seven of Pentacles in reverse, they also feel that you are no longer waiting for them. But, you know, they're finally realizing it looks like Seven of Cups in reverse, finally not being confused or that they will finally know that you are actually the one for them. They may have explored elsewhere, uh, meeting other people, but they feel like you're still the best, okay? Five Pentacles, they feel lost without you. They do miss you. Uh, they feel like, you know, both of you have been through a lot together, ups and downs, right? And they may feel left out in the cold right now, as in 
I just feel like they're struggling without you, okay? You use, I feel like both of you use to support each other in some way, shape, or form. All right, Leo, we're uh, going to get you some advice if you're interested. Love advice, okay? Not everyone is open to receiving advice or listening to advice, but if you are, this uh, device for you, okay, Leo? Love advice for Leo Spirit. Six of Cups in reverse. Perhaps the advice is not to return, at least not right now, okay? Don't take any action towards wanting to return to your person. Um, maybe it's not the right time yet, okay? Eight of Wands in reverse, three of Wands in reverse. Don't communicate with them and turn your back on them, okay? Because that will make them rush back in with the Knight of Swords here. And Queen of Wands, um, Spirit so saying to understand your own power, okay? Your feminine power here. Queen of Wands is a queen. Doesn't matter he or she, even the guy has feminine power. <laughs> so make a choice to, like a conscious choice to not pay attention to them. And six of wands here, this is when you're going to see victory because death is here. Also, it feels like Spirit saying to put an end to this connection with this person but it looks like when you do that that's when they are going to try and return and perhaps keep your options open with the six of ones all right leo uh we're going to get you some money advice if you're interested but if your money is good career is good don't need any advice then that's not gonna that's not gonna be your reading okay it's only for those who need to hear it money advice for leo Nine of Pentacles, very important that you are independent, self-reliant, perhaps working for yourself. Nine of Pentacles could indicate that. And with the King of Swords, be uh, strategic, use your intellect, be, logic, be logical, be practical. And I feel like it's like, mm, okay, that's King of Cups and the King of Pentacles. I feel like this could mean some sort of relationships or friendships that you have with people. It's important to maintain that. Um, that could be your strategy to have these people on your side, people who can help you. Okay, uh, Nine of Cups here in reverse. Also, you know, King of Cups also could mean do something that you love. But at the same time, be the boss here, King of Swords, whether you're a boss or not. But, you know, be logical and be practical with your approach. Mm, time to work hard. <laughs> Eight of Pentacles is in reverse and the Nine of Cups here. Perhaps there needs to be some sacrifice. Um, Perhaps, Leo, you need to work harder, like 10 times harder than before, okay? And Spirit says temperance is here. Make sure you keep check with your temper, okay? Don't, don't, uh, how do you say? Don't lose your temper. <laughs> be patient here, okay? Judgment in reverse. Let bygone be bygone. Something about not returning to your past job, okay? Leo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And if you guys are interested in watching your 2022 prediction reading, link is in the description box below. You can just click on it and I'll take you straight to my second vlog channel. There are timestamps there. But if you are more interested, uh, if you feel that it's easier for you to go straight to the video, I'm going to insert the video on the screen. All right. Take care, Leo. Bye.